America's driver. And we welcome you to Death Valley. And for the next three hours or so, this is going to be the Tiger Television Network. It's the SEC season opener for LSU and Auburn. Booty and Craig Nall for the quarterbacks start. Yeah, but there's no certainty he's going to be the quarterback at the end of the season. Much less end of the game. Maybe over the middle, and it picked off. That's Kenny Kelly. Out of bounds inside the 20 yard line. Who is the punter by trade? But Robert Baronis, last week's field, kick, field goal kicker, didn't do all that well. But Duvall does and gives Auburn the early 3 0 lead. Auburn had a gift, and all they could do was cash in three. So it's third down and five yards to go. So one real offensive play to speak of to this point for the Tigers. Make it two. First down inside the 10-yard line. That's Tavares Robinson, the freshman from Miami. All of a sudden now, Lou Tepper's coming after Ben Lear. The other side of the coin is the LSU offense hasn't shown anything. No, and so you might as well put another three on the board. And conversely, let them start back inside the one. I'd go for it. Damon Duvall, and it's a fake, and it's going to be a touchdown. Damon Duvall with the touchdown. How about them apples? Well, he hurt you. <laughs> it's a gambling style territory back at the 31 yard line Rusty Williams a single setback Williams has some room Rusty Williams down the sideline and right out of bounds near the 40 yard line of LSU by Ryan Clark a pickup of 28 yards on the play Right now, LSU not putting up much of a fight at all. Third down. And a foul foul. Laird of time. Sideline. Touchdown! Ronnie Daniels. How the LSU Tigers have no idea what's hit them. How about them Laird? John Corbello will try a 36-yard field goal. Hit the couple from 50 in high school. That's the way this first half has gone for the LSU Tigers. Yes, they did. Well, whatever it was, he... Uh, he moved. He zigged when he should have zagged. Here's Laird throwing long over the middle, and it's caught! And he's going to bust it! Ronnie Daniels fumbles the football! Who's got it? Oh. Auburn! And Daniels finishes the play with the touchdown! They, they need help. Somebody's got to make a play. Wide receiver, running back. Well, we've got a minute and 58 seconds to do something. Booty fires. Incomplete and nearly picked off. And is picked off by Adelaide Trone. <laughs> Tipped by Larry Kasher, who's been all over the field today. And is Clifton Robinson as a single guy. Coming after him, too. Third and a long three. And Laird's going to throw for it. Over the middle. And 35-yard line, and finally out of bounds, Marquise Cooper, and another first down. A killer play for the LSU Tigers defensively. 44-yard field goal drive. Jacob Allen is the holder. From 44. On its way. Got it. 27 to nothing, Auburn. 
sun may be setting here in Death Valley, but it looks as if the sun is setting on LSU. Quite a performance this afternoon for Ben Laird and his Auburn Tigers. The junior quarterback at Dothan, Georgia, 13 of 20, 238 yards. And you see how much better he is today than what he did last year. And he's throwing long down the sideline, and it's caught by Reggie Worthy. Inside the 25-yard line. Auburn's having their way today with uh, LSU in every phase of the football game. Clifton Robinson is now the single back behind Ben Laird. And here comes Clifton running for the near side. Clifton's going to score. LSU has really become a dispirited lock. Same thing, Priscillo, the guard. Well, that's not exactly what Jerry DiNardo had no. in mind in the beginning of the day on this 15th play of the drive. The last thing in the world he needs is a team that's been beaten up at home and a quarterback controversy, but he gets a touchdown from Ed Dangerfield and Booty with the touchdown pass. And finally, LSU is on the board. Bringing us along today. Has it made it awfully easy? Enjoyed being with you, Charlie. Good to see you, Coach. On first and ten for LSU. Indeed, our thoughts are Ron and his family, a fumble, and Auburn's going to pick it up. That's what, when James you talk. James Callier, 51. Yeah, when you talk to LSU coaches, they got to learn defenses. Second down, ten and a half minutes left. He still has it, Laird does, and it's going to be a touchdown for Auburn. Jack Schweiger, who last week had his first career touchdown pass, this week it's his second. It's a Ben Laird show. For 208 yards. Well, let's see what they do, see if they can find it. The end zone, incomplete. Intended for Ed Dangerfield, and the killing has finally ceased. And it was a nasty beating today, administered by Auburn over LSU 41-7. Coming up next, senior PGA Tour.